Hey guys, it's Jackie. I hope you're all doing well. I hope you guys are having a great day. If you work on Monday through Friday, or yeah, this is the day before Friday when this goes up, it'll be Friday. And it is Candle Day Eve when you are watching this. I hope you guys are all doing well. I have in front of me, I did not count these candles, but this this stash here is literally what I'm going to look for on candle day, along with the candles that I mentioned in yesterday's video. I'm out of breath. I apologize. I was running downstairs and I was literally carrying like all my candles up the stairs. So tonight is Thursday when I am filming this. This will go live on Friday. I am super excited. I told you guys I have a work party the night before candle day, but I don't drink. So we're good. A couple of these I'm not going to go over in detail because we have gone over them a gazillion times. A couple of these I will talk a little bit more in depth about. So we'll start. I don't have them in any particular order, but these are candles that if I see on candle day, I will be snagging one or two of these. Um, I don't know how many I have of each of these in backup, but I'm just telling you which ones I will get. Pink Fairy Gumdrop. This candle is amazing. It's a dupe for a luscious snow fairy. Is it snow fairy? I always forget the name of it when I go to film. The scent notes are sparkling sugared berries, pink cotton candy, and a sprinkle of fairy dust. I love this candle and it performs really, really well for me. Um, my goal is to get two of these on candle day. I haven't really decided how many candles I'm going to get. I have two merch credits and a gift card to Bath and Body Works. So I have like that amount of that I wanna spend. And now that candles I'm hearing are 950, I have to adjust it a little bit because that means I'll get one candle less without spending more money out of my pocket. But if I get to my store and there is just like the mother of all candle loads, I might lose myself in there. So just heads up, there'll be a candle haul. Blueberry pie. Um, now the one that's coming out is the blueberry sugar donut, I think is what it's called or blueberry something. I hope it's this, um, cause I would pick up one or two more. I love this candle. You guys know that I've talked about this to death. Um, juicy berries, flaky crust, sugar crystals with essential oils. This candle hands down is in my top five candles. So if I saw this particular candle, I probably would buy four of those. I'm just being completely 100% honest with you guys, I would pick up four of these. Um, this one I talked about a little bit in my video yesterday, and I did order three of these online. It's the Vanilla Candy Cola. This was that, um, it smells good. It smells just like Bottle Caps candy. I have not burned this yet, so I don't know how it performs. But once I get my order in from my online, I'll burn one so I know. But if I see this in the store and it performs well, I'll pick up a couple more. It's fuzzy soda crystal sparkling sugar cane with creamy vanilla. And it smells just like a bottle cap, the candy. So cute packaging. Um, this whole line, you know, dropped like online one day. It was like only available for a couple hours. It sold out quickly. Um, I did hear Unicorn Sprinkles is hitting the store. Um, and I want to get at least two of those. Um, I don't know how it burns. I don't know the scent notes. I did watch reviews, but that was a few months ago. So I do want a couple unicorn sprinkles because I didn't get my hands on it. But this one is really good. I just haven't burned it. So I probably would get two more, maybe one more of these just to have a couple in backup if they perform well. Peanut butter and jelly. You guys know this was all the hype a few months ago. Everybody said this does not smell like peanut butter and jelly. Some people say it does. I don't really care. I love this candle. I probably have like six or seven in backup. And if I see this on candle day, I will be picking up at least two more. It's fresh strawberry jam, toasted bread, crunchy peanut butter, and a drizzle of honey. I just love this candle. I love how it performs. It's such a great candle. I love the scent of it. Yeah, I'll get two of those. Chocolate lava cake. I won't go into too much detail because I did talk about this candle in yesterday's video. It smells so good. It's hot fudge Sunday all day long. I'd get like two more of those. I won't go into detail about this one either. Strawberry pound cake. We talked about that yesterday. I want to get four of these. I already told you guys that. Oh, 
smells so good. I want All right. Sorry about that. Next on the list is Welcome Home. I want at least one more of these for Candle Day. Or four from Candle Day. This candle smells really good. It wasn't the best performer, if you guys remember, like burning here in the container. But when I chopped it up and put it in my warmers, it performed very, very well. So I think like one or two more of these would be nice. It's cinnamon sugar, warm apple butter, clove buds, brown sugar with essential oils. And it smells good. It smells like almost like if you take and cut up apples and you put cinnamon on it and you melt it down with brown sugar. It just... Like the insides of an apple pie. So I would get like one or two more of those. And if you haven't tried that one, I highly recommend it. I'm trying to put these last couple in some sort of order. So you're not going to be completely surprised when you see it. Okay. Oh, Lord. One moment. It's what happens when I start moving things around on my table. I am so sorry, guys. And then Jazz has joined us. So the next one that I want to get a couple more is gooey caramel or caramel, however you want to say it. This one smells good. I've burned this one several times. The scent notes are melted caramel, crystallized sugar, warm butter with essential oils. This is a really good one. This is what we all thought was going to be gooey marshmallow, and it is not. But it's still a really good candle. It smells so pretty. Um, I do like that one. So I want to get like one or two more of those. Uh, Tree Farm, I won't talk a lot about this one because we talked about it in yesterday's video. Um, I want to get like one or two more of this one just to have on hand. Crisp Pine Needle, Warm Cider, and Spiced Apple. I probably, to be honest, would pick up one more of these on Candle Day. Next is my beloved. This is my new beloved. It's the New York Cheesecake does not smell anything like cheesecake. I do not like cheesecake. This just smells so pretty in the cherry department. It's a very like fake cherry, but it's not tart. It's a sweet one. It's creamy vanilla, juicy red cherries, and graham cracker crust. This one, I'm almost through it. The only thing I would have to say is that the wax looks kind of milky, but you know, who cares? I love this candle. I gave one to my sister-in-law. I'm dying to know what she thinks of it. Um, but I definitely want to get like, I'm going to say four more of this one on candle day. Pumpkin peanut brittle. You guys know this is all my jam. I love this candle. This one I've burned several times. There's still a couple burns left in it. Um, the scent notes, in case you don't know, is crunchy caramel or caramel brittle salty peanuts and toasted pumpkin seeds this candle will fill your entire home i don't care how big your house is well i guess if maybe if it was over 2,000 square feet you might need to but i'm at 1700 square feet and this scents up my whole entire house if i see that on candle day i'm definitely picking up like two or three of those here's my beloved this is in my top hot bud sunday this came out at the beginning of the year. This is the Sweet Shop 2.0. This candle is one of my all-time favorite. It's definitely in my top five. If I see this particular candle, I probably would pick up at least two more of this one. I actually would surpass the chocolate lava cake and I'd get this one. It's gooey fudge, vanilla bean ice cream, and whipped cream. Sometimes Bath & Body Works brings back candles from the previous year or the year that we're in, like the older ones. I love this candle, you guys. This candle is just so warm and biting. It's, it fills up several rooms. I could smell it on a different level of my house. It just, I love this candle. It's definitely in my top five favorites hands down. Hot fudge Sunday, Yes, please. I'll save this one for last. <laughs> and then my butterscotch toffee is also in my top five. So just having grabbed, I think I did. I grabbed my top five candles. I'll recap it there in a minute. Butterscotch toffee, I would get one or two more of these. I have several in my backup, but this candle, I think I told you guys, when you light it, all of your neighbors the whole city can smell this candle. It is English toffee, buttery caramel, and a touch of bourbon. This candle is what I want 
all my candles to do. I want to light one candle and I want it to scent my entire house. When I blow it out, I want to still be able to smell it. That's what this candle does. And I love this candle. I probably would pick up two more. Love it. So I'm keeping my top five. Yeah, there we go. And then we have asked the Bath and Body Work gods, please bring this candle back. And if you name it something different, please let us know you've named it something different so that I can pick up 10 of these. Yes, you heard me correctly. 10 of these. This is my beloved gooey marshmallow. My all-time favorite candle with Bath and Body Works. It smells so good. I love this candle. I got it last year at Candle Day. It's torched marshmallows, brown sugar, and caramel drizzle. These other ones kind of hit those notes, but not quite my gooey marshmallow. This, I love the lid with the snowflake. I, if I, I'm not even joking. If I saw this candle on Candle Day, I would surpass all my other candles and I would only buy this one on what my budget is. I'm not even lying. That's how much I love this candle. And the packaging, how can you not like this candle with a cable knit sweater? Adorbs. So here you have my top five. My all-time top five Bath and Body Works. Gooey Marshmallow. Blueberry Pie. Pumpkin Peanut Brittle. And they're my tops because they perform well too. Hot Fudge Sundae. And Butterscotch Toffee. That is my top five favorited candles of all time with Bath and Body Works right there. These are all the candles I would pick up for Candle Day. If I saw these, I recommend you pick them up if you see them. I hope you guys are doing good. I hope and wish you so much luck on Candle Day that you guys find all the candles you're looking for. I'll have a couple of hauls, I'm sure, over the weekend. Um, I do have that online order I'm waiting for. I don't know if I'll do that in a separate video. I have some Scentsy I'm waiting on. We'll have to see. I hope you guys are doing good and I will talk to you soon. Bye.